Hey guys, I'm Coco. Welcome to brand new series on the Long Dark. So this is gonna be a new special series. It's gonna be a pacifist run. So there's an achievement that if you survive the first 25 days uh, without killing any wildlife or anything basically, without killing anything, well there's only wildlife to kill, right? You get the achievement. It's 25 days required. So we're gonna do that. I wanna do, I wanna try the pacifist run, especially because, you know, as you can, well, if you were watching my uh, latest uh, Forlorn Muskeg playthrough, you know that even having a rifle does not help you in any way if you cannot hit the wolf. You're still gonna die if you miss every freaking time. So, why not try a pacifist run? You cannot hit anything anyway, so let's try that. Okay? Okay. So we're gonna go sandbox version. Uh, I just wanted to say how beautiful this is. This is amazing. This has been here since like I think the Christmas has begun. But it's beautiful. It's it's really beautiful. So let's try a new sandbox start. Let's create. And I have not decided do you want to play in Voyager or Stalker? Like ugh. I mean Stalker seems hard to me. I, I'm not I'm not really the one that's really experienced player. I'm I'm really not. So let's let's go with Voyager. Yeah, let's go with Voyager. I think Stalker would be too hard for me, right? Probably too hard. Uh, because Hostile Wildlife here is coming and will hunt you down, and you know, it's, I cannot kill it. So, I think Voyager would be would be more sensible. So, I wanted to do something else here. Since we've been in Forlorn Muskeg lately, it's, it's fine, you know, uh, the new region and all. Uh, I wanted to go to Desolation Point. And I wanted to do a new kink on this series. So we're gonna do 25 days of survival. We need to survive 25 days without killing anything. But I'm gonna do a new twist here. We can only stay in one region for five days. So it's gonna be five days in Desolation Point. Uh, on the fifth day, we're gonna go, well, on the sixth day, we should be in Coastal Highway. And on 10th day, we're gonna be in Mystery Lake. And on day 15, we're gonna be in Pleasant Valley, right? And then on day 20, we'll go to Timberwolf Mountain. So that's going to be five region that we'll explore. So uh, I have not played in Timberwolf, Pleasant or Desolation Point. I've only been in Coastal Highway, uh, Mystery Lake and uh, Forlore Muskeg so far. So I think that would be a good thing to do, right? What do you think, guys? I think that would be an interesting thing. So let's go and start in the Desolation Point and let's see how that goes. I'll play as the lady because I, I really think that her voice acting is amazing. Way better than this guy's. I'm not saying that he's not awesome. Just saying that I prefer her. So it's gonna be YouTube Pacifist. There we go. YouTube Pacifist and let's, let's let us begin. Let us jump in and let us hope uh, the pacifist ways of my playthrough will actually talk to the... will speak to the wildlife. And prevent them from right I hope so uh, there's another good thing here that we're gonna be doing pacifist because I now don't need to carry a weapon with me and a rifle is like four kilos so it's a good thing right so where are we I have no idea since I have not been here before I do not know well that's fine I guess I guess we'll find soon Soon enough. Uh, we have three hours of daylight left, only it's minus 15, so we need to find a shelter soon enough. Let's go ahead and do so. Let's go ahead and try to find a shelter. So let's consider doing some challenges, but I think the challenges the game has set are still I'm, probably too hard for me. I mean, I want to do, do the hunted one. Oh, is there a buddy? There's a buddy here. That's good. I want to do the hunted one, but I'm, I'm like, scared. I'm really... It's a broken ridge. Uh, we don't need crow feathers because those are used for um, hunting. I'm gonna take the bandage, search you. There's a broken arrow which we don't need. I'm gonna take the chocolate bar. Good enough. Good enough. So as I said, I have not been in Desolation Point before, but I've seen others play in this region. So that's gonna help me. And there's already some structures here. So let's go ahead and go there. If I'm not mistaken, this is uh, the Hibernia processing, which is where they were tearing apart them uh, whales. Because this is the whaling industry place, desolation point. Let's go ahead and try. Is that a fish? Is there a dead fish here? 
Wow. Like this has been here a while. Let's take it. 870 calories. Don't mind if I do. Mind if I do. I think this is Hibernia processing, if I remember correctly, from watching other pl people play here before. And I do know that they have encountered wolves in this region, which is something I really don't want to see myself. Yeah, minus 15. We really need to go inside. And when we are inside, I'm going to check what kind of clothing we are wearing and all that awesome stuff. But you know what? We're pacifists, so uh, for now, let's try to avoid any and all wildlife. Maybe sprint a bit. That's gonna make me warm. <laughs> I, I do hope that would be the case, that, you know, sprinting around. Well, not that maybe at minus 16, that's, you know, that's crazy, but at like, I don't know, minus 3 degrees, if you sprint, you gotta get warm. You know, with all the clothing on you, you gotta get warm, because sprinting through that, uh, yeah, Hibernia processing as expected, this is fire barrel, and let's go search this area, let's see what we can find. So. We need to spend five days in here. And you know what? I'm going to go around and try to explore. I'm not going to just stay in one place. Especially because we can't really find everything we want at the same, in the same place. Uh, cardboard box. I think I need a knife. Right? Oh, I can do it without knife. Good. It's good to know. That's yeah, good to know. These shells does not, do not carry anything of importance for me. So there's that. And here's some peaches. Good. Nice, nice, nice. We have found some peaches. I like peaches. Peaches are good. Is that a first aid kit? It is. Let's see if you can get something Nobody good. Swimming kit. Anymore. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm not gonna say no to anything right now. Well, unless we find a weapon. I'll, I'll have to say no to that. I'm not gonna carry that with me. That's a book. You can burn. There's uh, soda. Take that. Good, good, good. Search the plastic there. Dusty dog food. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Now, um... Just clawed, good. I can't see. There's a metal container. Good. Take it. Prime gloves, nice, nice, nice. So um, I'm still shaky on the details here uh, for the pacifist run. So if someone can confirm this for me, that would be lovely. So um, I only have some wood matches. Strike it. I want to see what do we have here. Nothing. Nothing is the answer. Okay. Uh, that's an old bedroll. Need a hunting knife. Sure we do. Okay. Um, so I'm still, I'm still kind of shaking this detail, but I'd like to know. So can you, can you fight off the wolf when he attacks you? And uh, if you have a knife, if you hurt him with that and he bleeds out and dies, will you still get the achievement? Okay. And there were some, uh, some people that said yes and some people that said no. So I do not know. Uh, so if you guys could tell me, that would be great. If you know for sure, that would be amazing. Let's go search this uh, vehicle here. Search it quick. Yeah, I know, you're cold, lady. It's fine. Beef jerky. Take it. Glove box. Let's search that. There's nothing here. What about up here? Wisers. Nothing. Okay, I'm not gonna go through there. Thank you very much. I'm just gonna stay on the inside. Whoa, I'm up here? Why did you pop me up here, game? What do you do that for? What do you do that for? Uh, we're gonna go in this big place. Just be wary. There might be wolves around. So, gotta be careful. There's the stairs. Let's go up there. See what we can find. It's minus 11 and I'm numb. Oh boy. Uh, there's something here. Let's search that. I know, I know. We need to stay inside. We need to find someplace warm. In a pry bar. Maybe we'll find this it. Stuff will come in Flares, here. good. And that's pretty much it. Well, there's good. We can uh, scare the wolf with that. And we haven't had one before. Are you lagging when you're walking or something? I know. I know. So, yeah. Please do tell me what do you know about Think the numb. thingy. Uh, about can we fight back from the wolves? I would say yes. I would say yes. That probably should be the case. There's a hole in our soul here. And if one thing I learned is that we have found a summit soda. You know what? Food right now. Seems good. Let's see. Let's check our inventory. 11 kilos only. Uh, let's check our clothing first. Oh, yes. We have found gloves. They're bad. Wear them anyway. Uh, we do need lots of outer layer stuff. We are wearing leather shoes. It seems like some Nike shoes. I don't know. Wow, we need so much uh, clothing here. This one is not locked. 
Please give me something. New sprint. I'll take... Oh! Okay, this is gonna be good for outside. Yeah, I'll take that. Wearing work gloves might be better than the ones we are currently having. This feels like minus three in here. It's awful. Uh, wear this, please. Good. Really? It's minus three in here? This is... this. Is, oh, I already searched that. I'm stupid. This is bad. We need to find a place to stay that's not so bad. These ones are better. Wear them. Thank you. Only minus two, boys and girls. But if we can find some more stuff, you know what? I don't think I'll search this tomorrow. We have two hours of daylight left. I don't think I'm gonna go and search the other card here. And we can search this tomorrow. Yeah, I think we're fine on food. So uh, let's go out, out and about. Since we are in Canada, out and about, let's go, a boot, a boot, come on doggy, go ahead and walk, go ahead and walk, in by walk, oh, heard a wolf, heard a fucking wolf, it's not good, it's not good at all, I don't see where one is, but I wanna go inside, here, come on, don't stuck, me. don't get me stuck, Urgh. Jesus, <laughs> stupid, okay, we're in zero degrees. Okay, it's better. It's better than the other side. But if we can find warm on clothing, it's gonna be good. And if we get to sleep, we'll be fine. We can get warmer. Please take the whetstone. Storm lantern. No, we have if we have one, but I'll take this one as well. God damn, it's cold in here. Zero degrees is not good. Please be the positive zero. We only need like one item of clothing, one extra item of clothing, and we're we're set to survive in here. We are set, all set, boys. In the book, and let's go search in here. This is a very broken metal bed frame. Sure, nothing there. Cardboard stuff. Here's some scrap metal. We're not really gonna make anything of that. I don't know if you can fish and eat those fish, but I'd say probably not. That would probably go against. Probably useful. Oh, that's probably useful indeed. Uh, what's that? Oh, just broken metal door. Okay. We are extremely numb. There's something there? The floor? I think. No. There's just a, just a pipe. Just a pipe dream. It's fine. Uh, this is the exit. Don't really want to exit right now. We are probably going to stay here for the night. And uh, let's sleep for one hour. That's going to give us some warm bonus. And that's going to make us a bit better. We'll feel a bit better at least. Uh, I know we will not have any daylight left. So, yeah. Good, good, good. I really need that one piece of clothing. That would be so good. Because we cannot sleep. You know, we are not tired. <sighs> God damn it. I have to go find something in that other other place need to do it need to do it we need to find another piece of clothing please game just give me something good just give me something good that's all i'm asking here and please let there be no wolves around i see no wolves need to find some place to escape this cold yeah i know could you like not get stuck behind this shit this shit is not something you should get stuck behind let's go back in here it's minus 17 outside jesus you know, when you start a new game with the Resolute Outfitter um, gameplay here, <laughs> it really hurts because you're used that you can just walk outside, it's like 10 degrees, feels like, all the time, almost, because you are wearing all the double clothing and shit, and it's really giving you a lot of protection, and then you start a new game and you're wearing like nothing. I already searched that, okay, don't mind it, just go back, just go back. Um, let's see, can we find something good in here? So, file cabinets. I wonder if someone put any clothing in the file cabinets. I would say probably not. Soda, I'll take okay. it. I'll take the soda. I'll take nothing else. Well, so our basic thing here is we need to find more clothing. That's really important. There's nothing in this fucking... File cabinets, god damn it. Gosh darn it. Ah, <sighs> oh well. Oh well. 
I don't wanna be stuck in Canadian wilderness. Da -da 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 don't wanna fight bears and stupid wolves. Da -da 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 don't wanna eat gamey venison. Da -da 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 don't wanna try to cut stupid rabbits. Get caught by them or catch them or something. There's a candy bar on the table. We are awesome in this stupid nation. We are Canadian wilderness people. Ah no, I'm just saying stupid stuff. Don't mind. It. Oh, feels like one degrees. Yes, we have one voice. This is it. This is it. Oh, good, good, good. I haven't even checked if we have a bedroll. We do have a bedroll. We should have one. So there's that. Hello, darkness, my old friend. I've come to take your thing with again. Good, good, good. Let's see. There's a corpse serenia up there. Corpsey, yo, you have a torch. Well, it's gonna be useful, I guess, against the uh, wolves. Fishing tackle. I don't think we need that, right? I don't think I can fish. But I'll take it, and you guys please let me know if I can fish or if I cannot. Please don't troll me. I know some people would like to troll me. You know, it, otherwise you can always troll me. I like that. It's, it's a fun interaction. But in this case, I don't want to fail the achievement, you know? <laughs> I really don't want to do that. I really want to do do get this one. I you know I got hooked on the achievement. I I've done 50% of them so far. So of course the other ones that you know require you to leave for a, a lot of days, those ones are not the ones I have already done, and it'll probably be a while while I'll still before I can do them. Um, but otherwise, I'm trying to do my best. I got one of the more rare ones, which is really surprising to me that it's a rare one. Uh, it's actually... It's like 1.2% done. The only thing that's less is the 200 days survived. So this is the one that has you... Requires you basically to survive... Not to survive, but to search every uh, single indoor area in the Mystery Lake and the Coastal Highway. So I think that's pretty easy. There's a hunting rifle, boys. There's a freaking hunting rifle. Well, if this was a normal prey, prey through, I would be very, very happy. Very happy panda. For now, we'll just put it inside of a bed. No one can find it there. And we have found a hoodie as well, which is great. Which is great. We can put it right there where that thing is going to give us some additional feels like bonus. <gasps> Oh, trail boots. Those are going to be good as well, you'll see. Hopefully they are good quality. They are 94 quality. It's amazing. These ones are crap compared to this ones. Yeah. Awesome. I like it. I have less sprinting capabilities, but you know what? Screw it. I don't, I don't even care. Uh, you're probably empty, aren't you? Yes, you are. Is there anything down there? Nothing. Nothing is down there. Welcome to the new kind of nation, all across the Canadian nation. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, useful. I don't know why I'm singing uh, Canadian idiot today. I just, I just am. Just am. Accept me the way I am, please. I am the way I am, and I am the pacifist. And the only reason why I'm a pacifist here is uh, that I cannot freaking hit anything with a fucking rifle. When I need to. There's a workbench as well. That's good to know. Grab the accelerant. Good. Probably don't have like any any wood. Cloth will take because we need to repair a bunch of stuff. We need to. We need to. We need to prepare for a long travel. Long travel. There's something. There's something creaking around here. Oh. 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 Good. There's wood here. And there's a fire barrel if I want to cook my huge salmon. Because you know, ladies, my salmon is huge if you know what I'm saying. If you know what I mean, my salmon. Ugh. Oh, there's a safe. I know how to open a safe, but that's probably going to take a while. But you know what? Can we do that in darkness? Let's try doing that. That's going to be like... Uh, please extinguish this. That's going to be like one of the, the most fun things we've ever done so we need to go counterclockwise right oh there's a timer 
if I'm not mistaken, we need to do counterclockwise on the first tumbler. Uh, let's see if you can do this. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this. This might take a while, but who cares? My timer has sounded, but who cares? Uh, this is going to be some extremely interesting gameplay now. So, uh, if you want to hear a story, I'm going to tell you a story. Just let me craft one in my head. So, I was I was driving driving outside right now. It's it's dark outside, so if that's important, I don't know. Uh, I went to pick up my brother and I went to do some grocery shopping. And there was a rabbit that ran in front of my car. Of course, I was driving slowly because I'm a good person. Um, and I, I didn't run over it, don't worry about the rabbit. But he stopped in the middle of the road and I stopped as well. And then he proceeded to run in front of my car for a while. Yeah, for like five meters he just ran on the road because he thought he's a... He's a fun person, I guess. Yes, we've done the first one. Let's go on the other side. Into the other side. So first one you do counterclockwise, second one you do clockwise, and the third one you do counterclockwise again. And then it opens, and you, then you can find some good stuff in there. So let's hope we do. So that rabbit uh, reminded me of the freaking rabbits you can see running around in the long dark. That I can never snare with my snares. I don't think I've ever snared a rabbit. Don't even know how they properly work, those snares. But you know what? One day, one day boys and girls, I will learn. I will learn and we'll see. Uh, could you like, please, get to the second one? That would be beautiful. I hope this one is not different than the other ones. I opened like two in Mr. Lake and they work like this. So I hope this one works like that as well. Come on, lady. Come on, lady. I'll call this a lady. It's a lady, right? I'll just do it, okay? Just do it. You could, you could have done this before. I might be, you know, I could be pressing this faster, but I'm afraid that I'm gonna miss it if we do press it faster. So, please, please, let's do so. Let's do something about it. Come on, tumbler number two. We're already there. Almost there. Have we done, like, full circle already? I think we have done, like, full circle, haven't we? Yes, almost there. Okay, let's go back in the other way. Back in the other direction. So, you know what? Because of this opening, this is going to be a longer video for a couple of minutes. Because, you know, why not? Why not? Ah, oh, let's open it. Yes, we've done it. But because I'm a cruel person, I'm going to say thank you for watching. And we're going to open this next time. <laughs> I'm such a cruel person. I know you want to see what it's in there. But you know what? You're going to see this next time. Uh, it's, it's, it's the first part of the series. So it's important that if you could share... And if you could like, and if you could tell me everything you think about this series and uh, about the questions I asked you before, if you could tell me in the comments, that would be great. But as I said, for now, take care of watching. Uh, don't forget to do your magic, and I'll see you next time. Coco out.